In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the vapor canister purge solenoid valve on this BMW X5. It's going to be located underneath the intake. Let's get into it. I'm going to remove this cover. I'm just going to use a trim tool, pull these push pins out. Grab the cover and it slides right off. Disconnect the connector for the mass airflow sensor. Just push down, slide that connector off. And there's two little clips holding this on. I'll just use a straight blade screwdriver. Pop these clips out, just like that. Can separate this. I'm gonna take these two bolts out, use a 10 millimeter socket. Take that out. that out. Grab the air box. And pull it up out of the way. And remove this wire out of the retainer. Set that aside. Using a straight blade screwdriver, we'll loosen up this worm clamp. And grab that snorkel. Slide it off out of the way. Disconnect the connector. There's a spring clip back here. Just push it down. Slide the connector off, out of the way. We'll grab the valve. Just gonna pull it off. There's a little bracket. I'm trying to pull it off the bracket so that we can disconnect the hoses. There we go, pull it back. You can see there's a hose attached to the front of it. I'm going to take this hose off. I'm just going to use some hose pliers to try to work this back and forth. Just pop that off. You can use a pick if that would work better for you. And you can see there's another tube connected to it at the base. Just squeeze the fingers on the tube. And it comes right off. You just squeeze that right there. And there it is. I'm going to take the new valve and we're going to attach the base first, same way we took it off. Get that lined up, lock it in place, and attach the other hose. Push that on, just like that. That looks good. And the mount. You're going to have that go through the bracket. Push the bracket on. Take the connector. Get that lined up. And connect the connector. Now take this intake tube, get this lined up. that back in place. Looks good there. Tighten down that screw. And just tighten down the worm clamp. There we go, snug that down, that's good. Now I take the air box, get this lined up. Place, push down on the clips. Get the bolts started. Snug those down. And connect the connector. Lock that down. Now I take this panel, get that lined up. Push pins, push those back, push them down, lock them in place. Mm 
then you're all done. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.